today is the day you face your fears. Your entire life, you have suffered from extreme pediophobia, nyctophobia, arachnophobia. You're visiting Dr. Okjape, a psychiatrist with a whole new type of treatment. Hopefully, he can finally help solve your problem. Ah, you've arrived. Just on time, too. Please, step into my office. Please, take a seat. Make yourself at home. Make yourself comfortable. Thank you for coming. I've read through your file and what brought you here. I understand you suffer from a number of phobias preventing you from living your life. Well, you've come to the right place. I'll be blunt with you. I find it most effective to dive right into intense treatment with my patients, for I find that fighting your fears head on is key to overcoming them. Fear is all in your head, so the head is where we must go. You mustn't succumb to this fear. No, no, no. You are here to take hold of that fear and wring it by the neck. You do want to take control of your life, don't you? Close your eyes and open your mind. Can you hear me? Good. You're in your childhood home, though it's not quite how you remember it. Please, I encourage you to search around. Don't be too afraid just yet. Ta-da! Mouse Diary here, and welcome to Fear. P-H, not F-E-A-R. Now, I don't wish to scare you while you're under, but there is one thing I've forgotten to mention. Some patients find this method of treatment a little more, let's say, difficult than others. In order to keep yourself sane, you'll want to keep a distance from your fears. This is just a standard precaution, however. Just make sure that you're a comfortable distance away from what truly eats away at your mind at night. But you told me to face my fears. What the heck do you- Ooh, piano! This is a student project too. Can I play the piano? Oh, oh shit, I can jump. Oh fuck. Yeah, let me jump on this. I can't play the piano, I'm sorely disappointed. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. What's over here? I wonder what could be behind these doors. I don't know. I don't want to know. Can I just, like, eat a sandwich or something? Yo, I'm hot. Why is there a lamp in the kitchen? Huh. You got some lovely art? Maybe these are the developers. What's this? Hello? What's this? So I actually like dolls. What happens if I like let her take me? Okay, bye. <laughs> what the heck is this? Wait, okay. Let me get a bat now. You know what? Let's get the bad ending later. Oh, what the hell is that? Looks like the lights went off. Must be something wrong with the circuit breaker. You should probably check on that. Where is it? What is this anyway? Kind of cool looking though. Where do I go? Yo, you didn't tell me shit. Okay, well, it's going in a default pattern. What's this? Here, oh wait, can I use that hammer? A hammer? How creative. Where did you ever get the idea? Uh, the voice creeped me out just now. What else is in here? Oh. Fantastic. You fixed the lights. Now let's see if you can fix the problem upstairs. Oh, 
hold up, I want to explore. You'll need to stay sane if you're going to defeat your fears. Don't get too close. What are you talking about? It's just a launch, What was man. that? Do you hear something? See something out of the corner of your eyes, perhaps? Ah! I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go! What? Fantastic job. That wasn't so hard now, was it? But you've still a ways to go. There are other things that scare you, aren't there? So, I, I don't know what else was in the basement, but he started freaking me the fuck out. <laughs> what is this? What is this? Yo, you don't even have a painting or a window. Yo, you need to replace your wallpaper. What? Oh. What's... Oh, I love them. No. This attic is quite full with boxes. Practically an explosion of things. If only there were something lying around to help you. Yo, I want to look at the dollhouse. Can he play? Can I crouch? No. I love dollhouses like this. I never owned one though. Can I go in here? No. Oh, well, I guess I gotta go here. Gross. Okay, that was over there. I'm safe here, right? Seems like you. <laughs> oh, I'm trapped. Oh shit. Well, where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? Where do I go? <laughs> oh, I died. <laughs> shit. Okay, let's try this again. Round number freaking two. Where do I? Oh. Congratulations, and welcome back. Now that wasn't so bad, was it? Well, that's it for fear. 
That was actually really cool. I like it. It reminds me a bit of older horror games, probably because of the environment and the models. And actually, I like that. There's not enough horror games that kind of emulate the old feeling of what they used to be. I have to give a lot of credit to the animations. I think it's really cool that they gave an animation for just opening a chest, opening a door and whatnot. I don't know, I just think it's a really nice touch. And the game just seems to have a lot of style with the scratches and the kind of old time cutscenes, I guess. And also great voice acting, so yeah. Good job, guys. This was pretty cool. Hope you guys got an A plus in your project. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. Hope you liked it, and I'll see you guys later. Bye bye.